What's going on everybody? Hope everyone is doing well. Reb Zev once again. And I want to kind of jump off of a post that uh, Shalev sent out. Uh, first of all, I thought it was amazing and courageous and unbelievably bold. So thank you. And I want to echo the fact that, well, let me, first of all, I want to say that everybody's being attacked um, and every group is being attacked. The Jewish people, the fact when we get attacked, it's a lot more sensitive because of history and all these things that have happened in the past and you know even just the recent past it doesn't have to be 60 or 70 years ago or thousands of years ago or hundreds of years ago it's just uh, it can be very sensitive when it involves the Jewish people however I do want to also say that everyone is getting attacked um, People are getting attacked in places of worship, all different types of places of worship. The disturbing thing about what's happened with the attacks on the Jewish people is that sometimes it is individuals. And I think that's what's most disturbing. Um, there may be other people being attacked who are parts of other groups. Uh, but we're not hearing about them as much. Mostly when you hear about um, other people being attacked, they're being attacked in their places of worship. Uh, I, I know that, uh, I know for a fact that mosques have been attacked and, and that um, Sikh temples have been attacked. Um, you know, churches have been attacked. So many terrible things are happening. However, it is particularly disturbing when individuals are attacked, are singled out. And I know, for one thing, uh, we are aware that Jewish people have been targeted as individuals for whatever reason. Sometimes the person has a terrible mental illness and then they feed into the uh, terrible lies that Shalev talked about, you know, uh, Jewish people want to take over the world, uh, these types of things. And so they use that as, as a reason to attack someone. And it's, it's terrible. It's tragic. And, and most of the people, if you look at the circumstances, uh, most of the people who do the attacks are suffering in some way from a mental illness or some sort of imbalance in their life, mentally, physically, spiritually, emotionally, and they're looking for a target. And they also have been fed things that aren't true, like Shalev said, and I can I can say it's true also that, you know, people think, oh, Jews want to take over the world and they run all the banks and this and that. I had a similar experience um, what Shalev was talking about in his town. Uh, I also lived in an area once, a very, uh, very big city, uh, a place that you would think this would never happen. And a man saw me and he proceeded to tell me what he thought of Jewish people. And I had to say, look, man, uh, I don't, uh, I don't run any banks. I think you have some misinformation. And he really did. And he was a very angry man, very hateful. But eventually, he and I could talk. And we were kind of friends in a strange way. Even though he always told me, he said, I wish you weren't so open about who you are. And I wish you weren't so Jewish. Basically, he would tell me. He said, I really like you, except that you're a effing Jew. You know, uh, it was a really twisted compliment. Um... So, yes, this is happening, and 
yes, we do bear resp some responsibility. We are not completely innocent. And I will have more to say about that in a few moments. Uh, but don't, don't give up, guys. Like I always say, do your best. Be your best. Find your best self. And use that for the good. And I'll be back in a moment with more.